Now, if you please excuse me, I have to go meet Bianca. Yeah, she's way back there. She's way back there. Sharon, please don't tell me you're going to talk to... Oh. <laughs>
Mm. Yeah. Hey. What you know about me? What's up, cats? I'm the Electric Jazz Cat, aka EJ, and today I'm ready to play some more Pokemon White Randomized Nuzlocke. Finally, here on the Electric Jazz Cat channel. Uh, as you may have could tell, I did some ending. What Jack Atlas say? And got pretty much everybody who was the original team up to level 30, except for Sleepy, who was our newly caught member on this route. And he's just gonna chill with the experience share. Uh, because I didn't want the grinding montage to go on for too long. And, yo, I just gotta say, John loves me. <laughs> this man, quote-unquote woman, uh, evolved into a gold bat. And the very next level evolved into a crow bat. And I know for a fact that's not how the Sooth Bell works, because Big was like, oh, give it to it, you know, raise the friendship. I gave a Sooth Bell to the freaking Chingling Pokemon when also I did the Platinum Soul Link. It never evolved. And I was like, all right. And yes, I know it has to be nighttime, and it still didn't it didn't go through. Anyway, I apologize about skipping on the story with Bianca, but I really wanted to get to this area because I could grind with other um, Pokemon and, and do that. But I made sure to save... The Sharon part, so here we go. Hey, EJ, Rocky. I've been waiting for you to get the insect badge, and now it's time to see which one of us is the stronger trainer. Alright, and see, I could have battled Sharon too, and then have all those trainers as well, but I'm like, Sharon's iconic, you know, people like Soda like his voice, so we'll keep him in. Also, notice in the Grandma 2, there were not one, but two trainers had Arceus, and one of them almost took out Danny, and I was like, let's not have that. Crying out loud. <gasps> Wait a second. No. Wait. Oh, there it is. Okay. I was looking for my, my Pokeball when we have the question of the day. Gotta have that on deck. Um. There we go. You're just gonna get yeeted. I don't know why I did everybody to 30. I think. Oh yeah, cause I was tired. In the uh, last two episodes. Kingler. Uh. We'll stay. But um. Hey, I got more energy now. Apparently people didn't like it because it got two dislikes, but you know what? That's fine. It's okay. Like I said, I was trying something different. Uh, I didn't know Kinger got hardened. I think I kind of knew that he got hardened in the back of my mind, but at the same time, I didn't. Um, but we got the sandstorm. You seem to understand the importance of the first attack very well. Yes, Sharon, I do. But what, 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 uh, what episode is this? This would be... What's today? What is today? Today for me is Sunday. So yes, this would be Friday for you. So that means that tomorrow is the Christmas special stream. And I... Okay, this king is going to be annoying with Harden. I hope to see you all there. As this is what I said it is. It's a, it's a Christmas special. It's something that I've always wanted to do. Uh, for a while, it's always been an idea that I had on my mind uh, with doing YouTube and, and, and Twitch and stuff like that. Ninkata, you know what, just to be on the safe side, let's just swap out of John because his health is low. And Danny can... Oh wait, I was thinking Ninja Assets, Ninkata. Oh well. We'll, well. we'll take... Look, see, Sharon ain't that, they ain't that tough. Can we, can we land? Thank you. Alright, awesome. <clears throat> Impressive, but why can't I win? I don't know, why can't you win? It's not clear to me. The reason you are so tough is the trust between you and your Pokemon. But that shouldn't be a problem. I can get more out of Servine and my other Pokemon too. Oh. Hang on. Hello there. EJ, do you have a second? Professor Junipa, do you need something? I called Bianca too, but I guess she didn't hear the call. I wonder what she's caught up in. Well, I suppose I'll just have to call her again later. Okay, I'll be waiting for you two in front of the gate in Vasa City. Uh, hello? I'm guessing that was Bianca trying to catch in there. The Vasa City's gate is straight down Route 4. Wait, why would we both answer our phone calls? Because then we're, we're literally next to each other. And then you know when you're next to each other, you get that like that <coughs> sound, right? Like the feedback, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? So like, why did both of us call? Why why not make it like so? If Bianca wasn't even gonna be in the call either, then just have like her coming from Sharon's speakers or something. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. 
Rocky Helmet! Yo, do I have anybody I can give that to? No! And I don't think anybody really needs it as of right now. Oh my star. Does this thing get rock slide? Let's try our luck. Alright, well we're- Ah! It gets roll out! <laughs> it gets roll out. Okay. Okay! Well. Does rock resist rock? Let's find out. It's neutral. Okay. Uh, we could mud slap, right? Is ground as good against rock? And accuracy and rollout's already bad, yeah. So then he's gonna miss and we'll be Gucci. Mmm. Yeah. Yeah. I see. Was that your favorite Pokemon? No. My fav- If I had to say my favorite Pokemon out of the team that I had, I love Sharpedo, but his moves in ain't that cutting really- it not, it, It's not doing well. Um... Metamech the Genesect is cool. I'd say it's a tie between Metamech and John. It's funny how that's, that's between the two who's doing the, the verses. Which, I guess by the time you're seeing this, if the title is correct, because it says it's actually the finale, but we don't know, that series is over. If not, it's almost over. Ooh, another psychic type, the Lake Trio, huh? Well, guess what? I got Menemek, his special attack's gonna download, that doesn't really help. So we're gonna Fury Cutter, and it's not gonna KO you, and you're gonna really, dude? You're gonna die one way or another. It's either from me or the Sandstorm. Imagine dying to a Sandstorm. I don't need it. Yeah, look at that. There were syndicals here. I could have had a little zero. Whew. Of course you're gonna fight me. Of course. See, I wanted to... Uh, why is everything a bad lead for John? What's going on? Uh, we still don't have a water type move. We have rough skin. That's nice. You love to see it. But I'm gonna go for the ice fang and not KO this thing. Because why would we? I'm surprised, too. Ice Fang landed, like, every single time in the grinding. When doesn't it have, like, not the best accuracy? Isn't it 90? Unless it's different. All right. <clears throat> Hello, EJ. Come here. Elsa called and was asking me all about electric-type Pokemon, and I thought about you guys. That's why I wanted to see you. Ta-da! Freebies for you! Here, Sharon. You too, EJ. Ooh, Ultra Balls. Ultra Balls! If you see a Pokemon that you want to have join you, be sure to use a good type of Pokeball, because this could be the first and last time you see that Pokemon. <gasps> Shiny, maybe? I know it might seem strange for me to say this, since I'm the one who asked you to complete the Pokedex, but please remember to enjoy your journey. Of course, I'm not saying you can just neglect the Pokedex, but you know that. Now, if you please excuse me, I have to go meet Bianca. Yeah, she's way back there. She's way back there. Sharon, please don't tell me you're going to talk to... Oh. <laughs> it seems the professor gave us the Pokedex as a reason to send us on a journey. At least, that's what my mom told me. They wanted us to go out and see the world, so my mom, Bianca's mom, and your mom made a request to Professor Juniper. EJ, what should we do now? I think I'd like to show the professor my thanks by going to Route 4 and catching some Pokemon I haven't caught yet. Good! Yeah, stay away from me. Do you give me anything, Master Roshi? Look at the electric voting board to see what's happening in Abasa City. <gasps> I'm gonna look in the trash can instead to find nothing. Okay. I was feeling that song. <clears throat> right, Gramps. We know you run the daycare. How do we know? Because we're Team Plasma. So careless. We're taking Pokemon away from people. Since you work at the daycare, we're thinking we must have a lot of Pokemon. Hand them over. What kind of nonsense is this? Eh? Ah. Oh, a strong-looking trainer. Please help me. If you're going to get in our way, we'll take your Pokemon too. Okay, bring it, Team Plasma Trainer. Look at that. I'm going Super Saiyan 2, because you know they're Super Saiyan 2 when they have just a little bit of hair that's in the front. But you couldn't tell from this angle now, could you? Oh, you kind of can now. <gasps> an Eevee! Oh! Can I have an Eevee? Yo, I'm pretty sure I've had an Eevee, like, in every Nuzlocke. So, we still gotta find one at some point. Swana? Not really scared of that. Look at that. Almost KO'd. 
almost KO'd. Almost, John. Almost. Plaz, why? Well, well, that's how the old ball bounces. This went downhill fast, so I think we better run. Let's hide at the amusement park. Yeah, tell me where you're hiding so I can come beat your butt later. Thank you so much. Please take this as a token of my gratitude. An egg? Oh, it's a brand new bike. It's always been on running around the Bassa City, but I never ended up riding it. Ooh, that nice red color. That nice Pokeball red. I have a daycare on Route 3. If you have any Pokemon you want me to raise, please drop them off. I just came to sightsee, but I got in a lot of trouble. <laughs> Alright, well... <gasps> hey, EJ, yoo-hoo! The professor told me Nabasa City has a lot of things to see and do. The music park, big stadium, small court, and the battle subway. I'm going to see the Pokemon musical. See you later. Alright, I'll make sure to not do that. Even though I have to, but we're going to skip that. Okay. Um, I want to fight N real quick. Because I'm pretty sure there's an N battle, right? And then I think after that would be a good enough spot to wrap the episode. I think there's also something important here. Nope, there's not. There's something in one of these houses, I thought. Maybe in this house? Like, maybe you? No? Okay, how about you? Are they talking about shinies? I'm not really a fan of shiny crocodile. Sunstone? Hey, but you know what? Speaking of shinies, question of the day. Oh, ho what is your favorite Gen 5 shiny? I know we've been a lot on the Gen 4 shinies a lot lately. Or not Gen 4 shinies, so Gen 4 questions. Like, you know, Gen 4 starter, Gen 4 um, fossil. But hey, we're supposed to be getting Gen 4 remakes soon, which let's see if that happens. But, well, that, that's another story. Hair strength, this is what I was looking for. But, question of the day, Gen 5 uh, shiny. What is your favorite Gen 5 shiny for me? I'm gonna say Embora. At least right now. I'm gonna EJ in post he'll um he'll look at the shiny Pokedex and if there's one that he thinks actually instead, he'll put that in post edit. And here we go. You're looking for Team Plasma, right? They ran into the amusement park. Come with me. Wow, what a guy. What a friend. He's gonna show me exactly where they are. Where'd they go? They're not here. Let's ride the Ferris wheel and see if we can spot them. I love Ferris wheels. The circulation motion, the mechanics, they're like collections of inelegant formulas. Elegant. Right? That's what he said? I'm sure that's what he said. First, I must tell you, I am the king of Team Plasma. Nice crown. Getz has asked me to work with him to save the Pokemon. I wonder how many Pokemon exist in this world. Probably an ongoing question. Oh, that music got loud. My lord, in! You're safe, sire. There's no problem. You're part of the people we brought in to help us save the Pokemon, so you're under my protection as well. Go quickly and let my battle cover your retreat. Now then, EJ, do you follow my logic? No, not at all. Why would he bring us to where they were and say they're here, and we still followed him, and then, like, then they came back? That doesn't make <clears throat> any sense. So that's how it is. That's unfortunate. Ah, then, the future I envision. Perhaps I can beat you here and now, but I'll battle you anyway to buy time for these members of Team Plasma to flee. Your logic makes no sense to me, and You literally, you're like Zamasu. He thinks because he's a god that the mortals don't understand, when literally his logic makes no sense. So because you think you're a king, a king, you think that I don't understand. Well, first the, 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 the almost star and now the Ammonite? What's going on? I know that you get rule out, so I'm going to swap right now. And let's go Metamec, you know, because you just can't go wrong with Metamec, right? This man, this man's literally got a cannon on his back. Like, what do you say to that? 
I know that's not very effective. I just want to get my speed up. And do a Metal Claw. I mean, he did leer us twice. So I'm probably going to swip, swap anyway. Swip, swap, swip, swap. You know, same thing. Uh, a Blaze again. Well, we're for sure swapping now. Um... Hmm... Let's go, John. John? Because Sharpedo still doesn't have a water type move. Plus, Blaziken is also fighting type, which is super effective against Dark. And let's go for a nice wing attack. What I love Blaziken. Look at that. One, two, three, out. I know when I fought N here in the game as a kid. Ooh, Rampardos. I used to, like, struggle with him so many times. Uh, this was a job for 1-Up. 1-Up, the Sharpedo. Because he'd have that freaking Sigilith. And I just could not defeat it. So I had to train over and over and over. And even still, I barely beat N. Alright, let's go for that nice Ice Fanga. That seems to always land. What? He barely lived. The fake Focus Session. Was that a crit too? Let's go for a guaranteed move here that we won't miss. Take down. He's got a lot of attack. <sighs> that wasn't even a crit. Rampardos hits like a truck. It's crazy. And a skip bloom? Tempting. Very tempting, Hammy. But we won't stay in. Just because, um, you know, low on health. So there we go. Hey, and see, Sleepy's getting them levels. Sleepy is getting them levels. The result was the same, but you, who are you? Oh, so you don't know who you've been talking to this whole time? You're quite strong, but I have a future that I must change, and for that future. Oh. I'll defeat the champion and become unbeatable like any other. I'll make all trainers free their Pokemon. Just try and stop me. If you want to be together with Pokemon, your only hope is to collect the badges from each area and head for the Pokemon League. Try and stop me there if you dare. If your conviction is not strong enough, you will never be able to defeat me. Well, apparently it's off the charts because I've beaten you every time. But alright, I think that's a good enough spot as any to wrap up today's video. If you cats have enjoyed and would like to let me know that you have, make sure you hit the like button down below. And in the next episode, I don't think we need to grind or anything in that sort. So we will take on the gym. I was about to freak out for a second. I was going to say, let's leave with Danny. But it's randomized. Leo. Um, and we'll be able to get ourselves our fourth gym badge. So either way, I'm going to get out of here. And I'll see you all in the next one. This is a zap. <laughs>